Okay, so the next thing we're gonna make is our fun Halloween chain. So you should have two white ones, two green ones, two oranges, seven black ones. So the first thing you need to do is get your faces on. So green obviously for Frankenstein and orange for the pumpkins. So what I did for Frankenstein was um, just draw right across in the middle. I just did a line like that and his hair kind of goes up and down. He's just got that straight across color it in. This is all with a black sharpie, which I gave everybody one, so you guys should have it. Hopefully I put it in the bag with these. If not, it's in the big bag with all your other stuff. And now I just gave him two eyes, dots, and then he's kind of got that. Like that. I did do them one at a time so that I took a break for the glue and then I made that the chains I did all of my characters first because the black is just kind of what's holding them together so you don't need to so I held it for like 30 seconds and then put it aside to dry so again it's that drying time I would do all your characters two, four, six of them first. Put them aside to dry. So we're gonna let that one dry. I'm gonna do the ghost again in the middle. I'm just doing two big circles and then a big circle -y mouth. Just ghosty, but whatever you want your ghost to be looking like, that's up to you. So it looks like this. Again, fold it over that little line across there. Hold it down for about 30 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good counting experience. Let's see, what are we all in third grade now? Fourth grade, oh my goodness. So you could be doing your times tables, third and fourth grade. So, and then put it down to dry once it's it feels like it's staying. Go ahead um, and do all of your characters first and then again let them dry for a good 30 minutes at least to an hour. Once you have that, come back together. Let me show you how to do, so you're going to need black. I'll show you how to put them together. So for this guy, obviously it goes in like this and we can't do one at a time because we're connecting these. So make sure. Your guys are facing the same direction, so it's gonna go in between them. And of course they turn, so it's okay. You know, you just have to make sure that when you have them face in the right direction that they look like that. And then get this so that it's a place where you can open it to put the glue on. Again, hold for 30 seconds. and then go on to the next one. So remember, because we had already done our characters, our Frankenstein, our Boo, and our Pumpkin, that um, the black is going to connect the two of them together. So one black goes between two characters, and then I, get, I did one on each end just to make it a little bit longer, okay? So that one isn't quite as long. Before you hang it up, though, make sure you give it lots of drying time. And then um, what I discovered with these is that when they do dry, because I didn't line, this almost went kind of flat. But you can go back in and kind of poke it down and make it a little bit rounder. It was, it was very interesting that it did that, but it lets you play with it a little more, so that might not be so bad. Okay, so have fun with it. Um, if you're not sure what to draw for faces, just Google Frankenstein faces. They have some really cute ones or ghost faces or just come up with your own. There's no wrong, no wrong way. It's your chain. Okay, so we're going to move on to what do we got left? Oh, our witch. 